All right, I'm going to show you some wild Mormon stuff. Early Mormonism. Adam God. Addressed to be all believers in Christ by Whitmer. Some other stuff. Now here you can see that this idea of Adam God is tied directly into the polygamy revelation because that's what this is here. The old chicken and egg question. All right, so we got Adam God, plurality of God, man becoming God, chicken and eggs, government of deity. Let's go look at uh, D.M. Quinn's magic, Mormon. I never thought much about the magic world view, but it is critical to understanding the structure of Mormonism. Because yeah, power resides in magic, and magic is practiced in the hierarchy. So this is going to be a series of photographs that simply shows some of the object used to obtain power and authority. It's not all legislation. So last we'll look at Whitmer here, see what he says. This is a copy. So uh, my question here is, if it was one letter at a time, why are all the transcripts in longhand cursive writing? There should be block letters, one letter at a time. I'm going to show you a little bit of what Mark Hart says about uh, Joseph Smith and quote Whitmer here. All right, this is the end here. This is Whitmer describing Joseph finding the proverbial needle in a haystack. 